In today's episode, it's Bali street food in the spotlight. So much of it. So sweaty. So delicious. So thrilling. Street food in Bali. Amazing experience. Come along with us as we try out all of these fantastic goodies. Hello, Teman Teman. Today we have a very special treat in store for you. We are here at a night market, Pasa Senggo Batu Bulan. We plan to try loads of different kinds of Bali street food, and I can't wait. Can you? Well, let's go check things out now, shall we? Let's go. Let's go. The time now is about 6:30. And people are just starting to stream into the market. There's a lot of motorbikes, there's a lot of activity, and things are just beginning to get started. Uh, what is it called? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Gorengan. Ah, Gorengan. Oh, okay, great. I have wanted to try Gorengan for a really long time. Okay, everything. Come, let's all try. Dua, 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 dua. <laughs> It looks really good. You can smell the crispiness from all the frying. Hello. Hi. <laughs> it looks so interesting. It's blue color. What is it? Ice. Pop ice. Pop ice. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Hello. Selamat malam. Uh, tolong dari saya uh, satu pop ice. It looks amazing. Look at that. This is our first stop. We always think that we will come to the pasar for a good meal, but we end up <laughs> with some dessert. It <laughs> yeah. looks amazing. It does look amazing. So we have. Uh, pop ice. Yeah, and escalier. Yes, and gorengan. So I thought we would start with something meaty, but ends up we are still with the snacks and the drinks. Yeah. But I don't mind. I am very thirsty right now. I'm looking forward to trying this. Let's go try your first. Mm. <laughs> How's it? I don't know. It's taste from childhood, you know. Childhood taste. <laughs> Some bubble gum. Or yeah. Oh, yeah. Paddle pop. Yes, it tastes like paddle pop ice cream. <laughs> you know the one. Paddle pop. Ooh, paddle pop. Ah, super duper yummy. That's this one. Babies is blue. That's why paddle pop was blue too. And <laughs> mm. Is that cheese? Yeah, let's try. Mm, it's mozzarella. Wow. Oh, there's mozzarella on top of your. <laughs> yeah, on top of my avocado, some colorful chilies, and. Yeah, some I see this is coconut. I know. Mm. Mm. Jet fruits and avocado, yeah. And susu. Mm. Surprise, it's clear. Mm. Now it's time for Goranga. <laughs> Very interesting questions. I don't know what is it. Okay, maybe it's taro. Okay, so actually the lady at the shop kindly told me which was which but other than this very recognizable banana <laughs> I'm a little bit confused about the rest already so I'm gonna go with this first Mmm! Mmm! Good choice Pisang goreng As you can tell It's very yellow banana inside, it's very sweet The outside is a coating of fried dough and it's actually really quite nice, crispy and the inside is hot and sweet and it's a little bit salty on the outside, a little bit savoury, very nice. Mm. Mm. Very nice. 
I like it. Mm. This little ball looks very, very interesting. I have no idea what is inside. I'm gonna give it a go and hope that I am pleasantly surprised. Mm. Mm. It's salty on the outside again and sweet on the inside. This must be a Balinese um, snack specialty. It's very, very nice. I like it. Mm. But it's quite mystifying. What is inside here? <laughs> Do you guys know? I don't. What is inside here? Mm -hmm. Mm. Mm. You know what? This tastes a little bit like it has some taste that reminds me of like Onde Onde, the, the Singapore style Onde Onde. It's nice. Mm. Ice the law. Okay, no, I keep saying ice the law, which I think sounds like ice egg. <laughs> the lady didn't understand me when I tried to order it the first time round. I think the correct way to say this is S the law. Yeah? <laughs> right. Making strides forwards with my bahasa. Indonesia. Okay, so this. I still love. That's me. I thought this was going to be a drink. It came like a dessert. Very nice, very refreshing. Mmm. Mm. Avocado with the jellies together. Very nice. Oh my god. Uh, this mark is actually so big, it's actually, it seems to be like two sections of food. And actually, the satay behind us looks absolutely yeah. amazing. We will back little bit later. Yeah. Now we go explore. <laughs> yeah, we want to check out maybe stuff that we haven't tried before yet. Yeah. And then we'll be back here. <laughs> it's so many choice what to try. You need to be, be careful <laughs> because our stomach already a little bit full. <laughs> because they have kindly provided a very nice place for us to wash with soap before we eat. Okay, so we have here a dish of uh, ayam geprek. It looks and smells really good. Mm, okay, I hope that spice is not gonna kill me because it definitely smells hidas. Yeah? And uh, we asked the uh, Ibu what this was. She said it was the lore. So I suppose this is fried crispy Egg? <laughs> Beaten egg, I think. It looks amazing. And to top it all off, we have ice day, the Indonesian staple. <laughs> and let's get started with the ayam dip, right? Mm, it's so nice. Wow. Oh, baby. Okay, I don't actually know how to eat this, but oh, okay, it comes apart really easily. Surprise! And okay, as with everything, always mixed with rice, that's what I've been told. So, together like this. Really, really tasty. Beautiful fried chicken. There's some marinade on it. Beautifully coated with some nice spices and a nice coating of uh, light spicy chili. It's 
it's been smashed and you can tell in consistency. Mm, it's really tender, easy, soft and mm, nasi putih along with nasi putih in the picture. Very nice. Mm. Beautiful. So many food in Indonesia. Street food, amazing. Mm. Every new dish what I try become my favorite. But all food amazing. Everything yeah. yeah. Mm. Mm. Look at this. Guys, I have actually no idea what this dish is called specifically. If you know, leave us a comment below to tell us because you know, we need to learn this, but this is really, really good. Crispy, it's crazy crispy and very, very tasty. Accompanied with white rice, nasi putih. Mmm, mmm, mmm. <laughs> I don't know how they fry this, maybe deep fried, omelette, I don't know, but it looks amazing and mm, so crispy. Mm, yeah, I feel it's a little bit oily, but very nice, very yummy. Mm, yeah. I wonder if you're supposed to eat with two hands or just one hand, but I am managing this with just one hand so far. Very proud of myself. Mm. Mm. Okay, smashed chicken. Very good. <laughs> Enak. <laughs> Enak banget. <laughs> mm. Mm. Beautiful. This is a fantastic meal. And for very, very little. So, every time we come to one of these local eateries, it just really brings back this message of how a really good life is possible here, even at very, very little cost. Really cool. This is a super cool thing about Indonesia. Bali. <laughs> yeah. So fresh. And always after spicy food is so nice to drink. Let's go try a new dish now. So much excitement going on behind me because I thought they were just fishing for like plastic fish but it's not, it's real fish and the kids are having so much fun. <laughs> playing in these ball pools as a kid you know you go in there and then you flip all the balls around fantastic memories Hello, my name is Kade Supriyadi. I can you wonder come here with the shop the name the Sari Segaro Murni. I have the fish pop, a soup and rice. I come to here in the shop the vegetable and the fish and then the pop. Fish and pop. Yeah. Sate. Yes, sate. Oh, okay, okay. How about we try sate balu? Yes. Sate balu? Yeah. You give me what you think. You want to try some? Okay, so we're back at the satay stall. We passed this earlier because it was actually very, very busy. There were no free seats. 
but now it's slightly quieter and we came back to get our satay pigs. It looks amazing. Oh, wow, it smells smoky and good. So this is what we have. We have a bit of tipat, um, which is rice cakes. Um, it looks quite like juicy and like well done. Steamed rice cake. We got a little bit of sambal there winking at me with all its red chili glory. The Lee here at this shop was really nice and friendly. So he gave us three different types of satay. We have satay lili, which is also fish. Kan satay lili. And then we have satay babi. And we have actual fish satay. This is our first time having fish satay. Really, really good. This fish is very solid. If you hadn't told me this is fish, I would have thought this is meat. But this has a very similar spiced taste to what we have in Singapore, something called ota, mm -hmm. which is also fish based. It's like fish paste wrapped in banana leaf. It's a good taste of fish, but very nice, very delicious. Mm. Yeah, it's got this nice marinade on it. A little bit sweet, a little bit spicy, and it's been like grilled nicely over the charcoal barbecue. Fantastic flavor. Mm. I want to top this off with a bit of teapot. Mm. Oh my god. This teapot really nice and chewy. Very soft, fresh, very nice. This sambal looks a little bit lethal, but I'm gonna give it a try. Look at that glistening, mouth watering. And here goes juicy rice cakes with a little bit of chili. Mmm, the sambal. Enak. Oh, so flavorful. Mm. Tomato based, really strong flavor. Maybe anchovies, I think. Very nice. Yeah, today trip to this um, pasar, very nice. We eat so many new food, so yummy. So, ikan satay lili with a little bit of sambal on top. Means. Cheers and salamat makan. Mm. Oh, it's very good. Mm. Mm. Very nice. It's very meaty, tender. Yeah, coconut, sure, and lemon grass. Very nice. Mm. This is so delicious. Oh my God. Mm. But this cake, awesome. Okay, now we're on to the satay babi. This is a delicacy in Indonesia which we are very familiar with. <laughs> but I have two sticks here. One is meaty and one has a nice big chunk of pork fat. Which is really really nice. But I'm gonna leave this for the dali. <laughs> okay, so here goes satay babi. It looks very fatty but very yummy. Nice marinade, a little bit sweet. Mm. Sweet, charred, with a good charcoal taste from that barbecue that it had. Spicy, chewy, succulent, succulent. Mm. Really good. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you too. <laughs> We've been at this uh, pasar tonight for already over two hours while we go around shooting and eating. And the people here are so nice. So many of them speak really good English. It's very easy for us to communicate with our limited bahasa, Indonesia even. And 
they're really friendly and they make us feel really really comfortable and at ease it's been really really nice so for dessert we are going to try roti baka and they have a really big menu on offer it looks really exciting i don't know which to choose hot roti bakar the smell is amazing there is chocolate keju and it's something called champo which i understand is mixed so maybe there's more stuff in there but so now yeah i'm gonna take a bite from the center because that's where all the good stuff lies look at this look at this magical amazing piece of food <laughs> it looks so good There's so much goodness squirting out of this bite. I taste cheese, chocolate, butter, and the bread, the roti, has been like grilled and it's like soft and juicy and crispy at the same time. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. Roti bakka. <laughs> Very, very good. Mm. I love it. Mm. Yeah, it's salty and sweet. And bread with butter, very good. Mm. Very difficult to stop. We always uh, eat uh, tirambulan, but this is roti baka, very nice, very yummy. I think it's such a bit tirambulan. Mm. That's it for tonight. Hope you enjoy eating with our street food in Bali. Yeah, tonight's visit to Pasa Senggo Batu Bulan was absolutely awesome. Everything we had was so delicious, absolutely enough. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the, this vlog and... Please subscribe our channel and click like for our video. Yeah, see you next Saturday on the next adventure. Yeah. Bye! <laughs>